Well then, the old man and the bunny. I'm trying to do themes now with with your name. Okay. Like last week it was band names. Yeah. So you were Buntalic. And uh, so this week I'm trying to go for classic books. Anyway, I've got a bit of weird news to talk about. Okay. It's weird news about a new data app. But the fact that it's like weird news will no doubt turn this podcast into one of those wacky morning radio shows. Yeah. 7.42 on the zone. 92 degrees outside. We've got some weird news here about a new dating app, you know? Yeah. It's what I figure our podcast will turn into. Yeah. So at first I wasn't going to talk about this. I was not going to talk about this wacky news because I thought it, you know, I didn't want to turn into a wacky morning uh, radio show. But then I thought, why not just lean right into it? You okay. know, instead of getting upset, why don't we just lean right on into it? So before we get to the actual wacky news i just want to let you all know that you're listening to bunny and the magic man right here <laughs> on soundcloud and youtube every week i might also i i would be the magic man obviously yeah and you're bunny i may also go for uh uh bunny and the bandito if i want to go for a racial thing yeah you know but i'm not sure if i want to go there or not so I'm either going by the the Bandito or the Magic Man. I like the Magic Man. I don't think the Bandito fully represents who I am, but it sounds better when paired with Bunny. Bunny and the Bandito, every mm-hmm. week here on SoundCloud and YouTube. You know? <laughs> so I'm not sure which one I'm going to go with, but anyway. There's a new dating but if we're app going on- to do, if we're going to do... If we're going to turn this more into a morning zoo thing, you know what we need. What? More kazoo. That's a good point. We do need more kazoo. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we need more kazoo. So there's a new dating app on the market. So Tinder is for horny men and non-horny women looking for Mr. Right in the wrong dating app. (laughs) Okay. That's what Tinder is. Then there's Grindr. Grinder is for desperately thirsty gay and or closeted men. Okay. And now there's a new dating app, and it's called Hater. Hater. Okay. Hater. Basically, as far as I can tell, it was made for people like me. I hate a lot of things. (laughs) So Hater matches people up based on what they hate the most. Okay. So, well, I think it would come in handy. How sweet would it be to to meet someone and you automatically know that they also hate Donald Trump and Game of Thrones? Yes. You know, hey, we both hate Batman versus Superman. Yay. That right there, that's common ground. You know, well, right off the bat, man, anybody I meet these days, I really need to find out about the Donald Trump question. Yeah. And yeah. and if they are for Donald Trump, I am running like they're a leper. Yeah. Yes. So I have a map here. So basically, a uh, hater has been around. The app has been out since February of this year. And the app has been so successful that the people who made the app released yet another giant map of the United States that has the most popular blank in each state. You see those a lot lately? Yeah. And they all seem like bullshit. Here's the most popular fictional character in each state. Bullshit. Doonesbury is not the most popular uh, f- uh, fictional character in fucking Oklahoma. <laughs> that is bullshit it's not like all of these uh, gun-toting rednecks are talking about the latest Doonesbury does, that, does Doonesbury even still exist? I believe so, yes yeah. so that's, this that's time, the comic strip you start getting into when you get a little older yeah, yeah <laughs> so this time 
the map has the so-called definitive list, according to the hater dating app, of what each state hates the most. Okay. No, I, of course, have the map right here in front of me. Okay. All right. But before we go into it and riff on it, I've got a question. Bun flew over the cuckoo's nest. Yes. If you were on Hater, if you were on Hater, Bunny, what would you put? What would you be putting? Like, say you can put like just a list of the things that you hate the most. What would you put on there? Um, well, we got to assume anything Trump or Trump related. Uh, yes. Then I would really have to, I would have to go with pretentiousness. Pretentiousness? Yeah. Okay. Okay. There's so many people that are just so full of shit these days. <laughs> yeah. I know exactly what I would put on mine. <sighs> Batman versus Superman, Wet Socks, Justin Bieber, Donald Trump, Pumpkin Spice, uh, sports, just just uh, sports in general. Also, I think that would really get women interested. Mm-hmm. So it's like it's like a double thing. Of course, this is Oklahoma, so like I I would imagine that if I want to connect with Oklahoma women, I would put things like uh, reading. And liberals and snowflakes and hell minorities. Yeah. Surprisingly, now that I think about it, I think I dealt with more racism in California than I did in Oklahoma. Because I've been thinking about it. Yeah. I have not had too many like really in my face racist incidents living in Oklahoma, but that's only because I look a lot like a Native American. Yeah. And Native Americans get a pass here. Okay. Because it's well, like, you're... oh, you're Native American. Oh, you're a minority, but since we're raping your land, I will not be racist to you. I love your casinos. <laughs> Is basically what white America says. So Sorry they, about killing a lot of you. Yeah. I have the long hair and uh, vague facial features of someone who could be one of a number of races. I don't look... I look Mexican, but I could also be a couple of other things. Right. So, I think I'm passing as a Native American. I think that's working. I need to come up with what tribe I am. Yes. I don't know what tribe I am. I need to figure it out. I am the Wanahakalugi tribe. Wanahakalugi tribe? Yeah, I'm the Wanahakalugi tribe. Can you be Wind Clan? Maybe. Ooh, that might work. Yeah. And that might What what tribe are you? Oh, Ravenclaw. Yeah. I'm the I'm the Ravenclaw tribe. So I've got the list here. Let's go through some states that we don't live in. Uh what people hate the most in each state. Um Texas is apparently sleeping with the window open. Okay. Yeah. yeah, they are Lynn. That's the, um, that's the biggest thing they hate. Yes. Yes. This map. Then why are they have... so bitchy? God, I don't know. I was gonna say if that's the thing that they hate the most, God, they could pass for Canadians. Huh? Yeah, and they are Canadians clearly are so nice. not. <laughs> yeah. yeah. This map does not have the names of the states on there, so this map has taught me a lot. Primarily that I know shit about states. Okay. So I'm going with the ones that I definitely know. So the big star, that's Texas. The the thing they hate the most is sleeping with the window open. Uh, workout, uh, uh, Florida, the thing they hate the most is workout couples. Workout couples. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever that means. Whatever. What's above Oklahoma? What is that? Kentucky? Yes. Yeah. And the thing they hate the most is Seinfeld. Seinfeld. Okay. That makes sense. Like, I imagine if you lived in the middle of America that you would also hate them. But I, damn. I, I, I am. Jews, you know? 
I am seeing how they're how what they hate is dating related. Okay. Yeah. No, you I know? can see that. Yeah. So okay. now sleeping with the window open. Texans Texans using uh, using a dating app naturally assume that they're going to be sleeping with you, and they like the window shut. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah, they're they're, yeah. they're putting that out there right now, you know, so there's no mistake. Yeah, Idaho, the thing they hate the most, asking for directions. Okay. The thing that New York important hates the most. important in driving to and from your date that yeah. the other person has this information. And it's really cool from a from like a social Darwinism kind of point of view, because if yeah. you have two people in the car and they both hate asking for directions, they can just wander off and never be heard from again. Yeah, that's a good point. That's a good point. It's really safety. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, a lot of these I think are bullshit, but this one makes sense. Uh, New York uh, State, like they can, like they they can accidentally run into a, a drug cartel. True, because that's how lost they got. Because they they just yeah. wouldn't ask for directions. <laughs> yeah, or Bigfoot. Yeah, yeah. The thing that New York hates the most: yeah. Times Square. Times Square. Times Square. Okay, that makes sense. That yeah. makes sense. Um, California. Because you know that's got to be a really popular date kind of thing if you live in the city. Yeah. Let's go to Times Square. Yeah. The thing that New Mexico hates the most, polo shirts. Okay. It's New Mexico, though, so I imagine just shirts in general. Mm -hmm. I imagine there's a lot of shirtless people in New Mexico. That's how I'm picturing New Mexico. Okay, I have a question. Where did you get yes. this? Where did you get these statistics? Um, from the Hater dating app. Oh, Hater Lord. is a dating app that connects people with other people based on what they both hate. All right. So is this a real yes. thing or is, or is this something you made up? No, this is all real. Um, in California, this sounds say, like something that you would make up. No, no, absolutely. Not. <laughs> in Washington State, the thing that they hate the most are those little K cups, mm -hmm. curry, keg, K cups. In California, it's fidget spinners. Okay. In uh, Nevada, it's feminism. Okay. What? <laughs> What's between what's between Just oh, that's Utah. <laughs> okay, that's Utah. Okay. So the thing that Utah hates the most, this makes sense. Porn. Porn, right. Porn, that makes sense. Now I'm gonna read oh uh 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 And then Hawaii. you get the dick pic. Yeah. Hawaii, the thing they hate the most is taking videos at concerts. I can understand that. Okay. In Alaska, the thing they hate the most is graffiti, which makes sense because how can you graffiti snow? <laughs> so here is just a list of things that uh, I that are also things that people hate, but I don't know. I don't know states that well, so I don't know which states hate this. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Uh, drinking alone. Trap music, bloggers, tying a tie, lift, waiting in line, people who use money clips. Casey Affleck is hated by an entire state on the East Coast, so that's exciting. <laughs> Just don't go there, Casey Affleck. Um, cheap coffee, friends that ask you to help them move, dabbing pizza grease with a napkin. Uh, some state uh, way up in the corner, in the upper eastern corner of america hates god okay and uh what is this is this kentucky alabama S something like that anal sex okay it's between texas and florida i'm horrible with states so here's the ones here's the ones that i think count at least that, for us it's probably louisiana yeah yeah i think that's it they <laughs> hate anal sex um 
Uh, Arizona hates sand. All right. Okay. I think that that's weird. Uh, Colorado, you would never guess. Nope. You would never in a million years guess what Colorado hates more than anything else. Marijuana. No. You would never guess it. Um, Ever. Cats. Well, no. Not even. This, well, we'll never guess it. So why am I You'll even trying? Why am I even it's trying? In sync. In sync. In sync. Okay. Yeah. Whatever. The boy band. And yeah. and then this, the Oklahoma one. This is when I know that this whole thing is fucking bullshit because this is like the biggest lie in the history of mankind. I think that a lot of these things that people hate are just things that people say that they hate like uh oh yeah i hate people that lie too but i lie all the time yes you know like let me say the things the thing that society deems that i hate so oklahoma's biggest is allegedly hearing the latest gossip Oklahoma is hearing the latest gossip. That's what they hate. Uh, Oklahoma's number one thing that they hate is apparently, quote, hearing the latest gossip. Hmm. And and yeah. and how? I, so don't listen to gossip. <laughs> yeah, I, I I I don't understand that. I mean, apparently it, you're up on the gossip if you know that the gossip is in fact. The latest gossip. Yeah, I'm so confused because you're not saying I hate gossiping. Right. You're saying I hate hearing it. That's weird. So you That's hate weird. not knowing it first then. I guess. Is I don't that, know. Yeah. It's confusing. It's confusing. So anyway, that's the list. It's 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 all over online and and um like Huffington Post and shit like that. So we became a. Uh, you've been listening to Bunny and the Magic Man. Right here on SoundCloud, iTunes, and YouTube.